Hey, this is Lord Brunson back at you with the back at you. So I got a lot of people in my comments like, um, oh, Nick, Nick Wright was right. Nick Wright was right. Nick Wright was right. Dog, the sun going to shine on the dog's ass at some point. If you keep betting on black, you're going to hit black at some point in your life. If you keep betting on the Eagles to lose a game, it's going to happen. Like, come on, what y'all thought we was never going to lose another game? Come on. The sun going to shine on the dog's ass at least once. I'm pretty sure that Nick Wright picked the Patriots to beat the Giants that, that year when they were supposed to run the table. Come on, man. This dude's been wrong more than he's been right this year. So please miss me. It's like, you, you, guys, you guys are killing me. All right, the Eagles lost. I fucking get it. We lost. But it's Seahawks fans that are less happy than you. It's 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 it's, it's people with teams in the AFC happy the Eagles lost. That game don't do nothing for y'all. Y'all got to worry about yourself. That game does not you cannot be happy the Eagles lost if the game doesn't affect you. <laughs> are you crazy? I understand Cowboys haters happy the Eagles lost because the Cowboys might not make it now. You know, this, this 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 decreases the Cowboys' chances. But if you are a if you are a Baltimore Ravens fan, why are you happy the Eagles lost? What sense do that make? It was two NFC teams playing, so how are you an AFC team and you happy the Eagles lost? That's what we call hate. We call that hating for no reason. You know what I'm saying? You you just fucking hating, bro. You don't even know why you're hating. It don't make no sense. It don't make no sense. Oh, Nick Wright was right this time. Whoop the fucking do. Good for Nick Wright. Good for Nick Wright. He was right this time. He been wrong all damn season about everything that came out of his goddamn mouth. And, and you know what finally jinxed us? When, when Skip Bayless said we was going to win. That's what that's I think that's what jinxed us when Skip said we was gonna win. Because he ain't never right about shit. So Skip said we gonna win, then the opposite happened. Oh my god. The Eagles like we're 10 and 2. We 10 and 2. We 10 and 2. Get give me give me a team in the NFL right now who got a better record than 10 and 2. Leave it in the comments. Leave it in the comments. Maybe I'm missing something. Somebody is somebody 11 or something? <laughs> Is somebody 11 or something? No, they not. The best record is 10 and 2. And we still got that. You guys kill you guys killing me. You guys killing me. The sun going to shine on a dog's ass at some point in the in in life. And it happened yesterday. It happened yesterday. And I tell you what, I guarantee this. I I guarantee we bounce back against the Rams. I guarantee we bounce back against the Rams. You think we're about to lose two in a row? You think we're about to lose two in a row? Doug Peterson, we got to do is turn Wentz loose early. Let Wentz throw the ball down the field early. Wait until the second half to get it popping. He played conservative. You don't do that when you want to win a shit. You got him kill, kill, kill. Kill, kill, kill. Teams who don't know who they are play conservative. We know who we are. The hell you calling that game like that for, Doug? Shit still got me hot. Nick Wright was right. One time, whoop de do. Good for you, Nick Wright. Good for you, Nick Wright. And Skip Bayless, please do not, do not wish us any luck. Don't say we're gonna win. Skip Bayless, just be quiet. Be quiet, because it's, it's it's like it's an underhanded compliment when Skip Bayless say anything good about any team in the NFC. He don't mean it. He putting this bad juju on us the same way he say the Cowboys gonna do this and that. They never do. They never do. We ain't worried about no goddamn uh, Nick Wright. Oh, he was right this week. This don't change nothing for us. We'd rather take this hiccup now than take it in the playoffs. I tell you that. It's fly, Eagles fly. We ain't worried. We're not worrying about that loss last week. We ain't worried about that loss. I tell you who needed that win more than us. The Seahawks needed that win more than us. We not. We not outside and looking in. We not on the bubble. We straight. We just gotta finish strong. We gotta finish strong. In my opinion, we got two more guaranteed wins left on the roster. Two more guaranteed wins, and that's against the Giants, and that's against the Raiders and the Cowboys. We got three guaranteed wins. Now, us losing this game, man, we just got to come out and go hard 
on the last game, possibly. The last game might really mean that game is for the division. But we're going to do it. Fly equals fly. Nick Wright. Get out of here.